Hey guys and gals, I'm Pal, and welcome back to Pikmin 2. When we last left off, we uh, beat the game, and it's been a couple weeks since then, and now I'm really happy to be playing the challenge mode. It took a lot of convincing, but finally Nova did agree to join me for this, so say hi, Nova. Hello! And so we are going to be playing challenge mode today. Also, do you notice the lines on, on the screen there? Look on the beetle. Yeah, what is it? I, I, can, I can't figure that out. It doesn't appear in-game. It's just on the title screen, and there's one here, too. But anyway, we are going to be playing the challenge mode. Now, I've waffled back and forth as to the format of the challenge mode. Uh, so at some points, I've wondered if I should just do one episode per level. But then I was looking in the guide just to get a gauge on how long these levels are. And you can see here there are two floors. So I'm going to play this one by ear, and if it takes like five minutes, then we're, we're going to do another one. But if it ends up being around ten, then I won't complain and I'll just end the episode there. I so, think we can finish it faster than ten minutes. Yeah, I think so too. But actually, I know so because the, the timers on these things are 100 seconds each. Oh, that's true. So uh, we're probably going to have to be doing maybe two or three. I think two might be enough, but we'll find out. Let's start with the Explorer's Cave. We get 50 Red Pikmin, four sprays, and two captains between us. Starting with the two-player challenge, let's go! I always like this because you get a, you get control of Louie, and for the most part we really didn't get control of Louie much when we played, because we... He's always lost. Yeah, we got stumped on the final boss. Oh, there's a cutscene! Oh! I didn't know this. I didn't remember this. Welcome to challenge mode! Find the key on each level and take it to the research pod! Try to reach the geezer on the final level within the time limit. Points are calculated based on the treasures you collect and the time you have remaining. Earn as many points as you can to achieve fame, fortune, and glory. I know. I didn't remember there was a cutscene. I thought the point was to get through it without losing pigment. Uh, that's the way you get the gold, or not the gold, the uh, purple flower for the mission mode. Uh, so you can complete it 100%. So for this, we're going to be focusing on getting every treasure and not on Pikmin deaths. Now you need to complete these with no Pikmin deaths at all in order to get the, the unlockable, the achievement. Uh, you have found a remarkable object. My analysis concludes that it is a key to the next floor. It looks oddly familiar. Have I observed it before? Perhaps I'm mistaken. It seems this treasure detects geomagnetic fields. It must have some geological effect. Isn't the key a reference to something? It is a reference to Super Mario 64. So, in case it isn't obvious, Nova's on the bottom screen and I am on the top. Uh, we're probably going to be splitting our Pikmin 50-50, but not always. Not always. Sometimes one of us will have a more important role of having the rarer Pikmin. But what was I saying? Uh, oh yeah, yeah. I will be completing these solo on my own, with no Pikmin deaths to get the uh, achievement, but for the sake of co-op, Nova and I will be getting every single treasure, so if we fail it- Oh, I meant to read that. If we- if we fail it, then we're gonna have to do it again just to get every treasure. But Pikmin deaths are largely irrelevant, because that would mean us grinding on some of the- the floors, and that's not fun. Now, I don't remember for sure, have we ever perfected every level? Yes, we have. It's- it's actually really easy to do so, if you- because you don't need any treasures. Treasures aren't even a factor. All you need to do is find the key and get to the next floor with no Pikmin deaths. It's pretty easy, actually. It's made a little bit more difficult by... Here, I think we took roughly half. Here, let's take out this bullboard first so then we can split up. Ready, set... Let's actually do this. We have four sprays and we're not marked down for getting them. There's the key. I have way more Pikmin than you here. Oh! Oh! Death. Okay. <laughs> That, that Pikmin was just doing stuff on his own, and I did not notice. Okay, so we have one dead, so I'll have to be doing this later. Man, it's weird. Future Pal actually has to play the game. Also, Nectar is really irrelevant, at least with this 
this cave. So, we probably shouldn't pay much attention to it. Okay, there's nothing there. We don't have a treasure gauge or the uh, the treasure detector thing in in this this challenge mode, but you can still hear the the completion sound. Look, the ground has cracked, indicating an inactive geyser. Have your Pikmin dig here. Okay, so you got that. Yeah, you got that. Okay, well, this is the last treasure, I think. Oh wait, you have one there. Oh, and also let's kill him. Oh, oh, hello. Uh, I don't have enough for that. Oh, wait, wait, I do. Oh, never mind. Here, let's, let's get some Pikmin here. Just to get this enemy. Here, I helped. Okay, you got that? Cool. Okay. Well, that's easy enough. Wait, what is this? Oh, it's just an egg. I punched it. I Oh, I just realized. Wait, guys. Oh my goodness. I I just realized. The thing where you get the double nectar is not a glitch. You know where have you seen the glitch or the the technique where you both put captains can get it? Yeah. Yeah. It's for this. Uh... You can I mean, I don't I'm not sure if there are sprays you can collect on this, but it's totally for this. So that's the proof. Now I'm justified with how much I have used that in the LP. Okay, so that's the first level. I, I'm not running a timer in these these videos because, I mean, we're timed in game. But I think that's justification for going on. Now, should we do it vertically or horizontally? Horizontally. Horizontally? Okay. Well, let's see if we can possibly get a pink flower on this. Because I think they get harder the further you go down. Yeah, I would agree. So we'll, we'll knock them out horizontally and then go down and do the next row. With this many white Pikmin, there's probably very treasures. Yeah, so we're definitely taking half and half. Uh, I didn't pay attention to how many sprays we have. Did you? No. Okay, well, we, we'll do that. There. So, did, have you noticed how good it looks in HD? Yeah, it's, it's beautiful. Like, the game looks better? Ooh, hello. Whoa. Yeah, the, ga the game will do that a couple times. Oh, purple Pikmin. Uh, I got this. And there's the key. Oh, hello. Get get this guy. Get this guy. He probably has a treasure in him. Let me get a purple. Did you get him? Uh, you got him. Okay, cool. Throw uh, a Pikmin on this. I think that'll be enough. Maybe? There. Th that'll be enough, probably. Yes, it is. Oh, oh no where is he? Where is he? Uh, where is he? Where are you? Oh, there he is. I can't get that. Here, let's skip that. Got him. Okay, cool. I didn't think I could get him in the the, the poison, but I did it. Good old doodle bugs, doodling across the world. Doodle on, bug. Doodle on. Okay. Uh, there's an egg here. That would be useful for the purples. Okay. Let's see. I'll throw this purple there, just get this done faster. Man, I, I forget how slow purples are, and it's exacerbated by leaf Pikmin. Also, it's really nice, I just realized, that we're not getting cutscenes for the treasures. That would be a pain. That would be such a pain. Oh, I was wondering why Pikmin were dying. <laughs> okay, so I have a purple for this. And a purple for this. Uh, we should probably... What do you think? Should we split the, the colors in the next cave? Or should we, like, each have purples and whites? Uh, I think we both should have purples and whites. Okay, that, that makes sense to me. Especially they, since there are probably going to be some enemies. I think they gave us more purple flowers than we actually needed. Yeah. Because I think now we have more purples than white Pikmin. You want to take the whites and go look in the corners in case there's very treasures? Uh, I think we should prioritize getting back all of the the treasures first, just to hear if there is the the gong saying that we completed that it. Plus, all of these are really slow. 
goodness, they're slow. We have a uh, spicy spray. That's true? Go go get the back one with that. Yeah. That's a good idea. Okay, but okay guys. Get that that sweet juice. Now you can go really fast. Oh, now they can go really fast. Nice. Okay, uh, you should go over by the cave. Just so when this is done, you can jump in. Okay. I'll, just, I'll make this go a little bit faster. Okay, come on, guys. You're burning through a lot of our time. You know, we probably should have started with the farthest and then moved closer. Well, it was hard with the poison in the Okay, that's it. We can leave. Or go further, I guess. Also, notice the little background to the the name of the cave? How good that looks in HD? I think it changes based on some of the caves. Yeah, I think I think so too. But I didn't get to see that in the main Let's Play. Okay, I have some Pikmin. I'll take these two. Okay. So, what are we dealing with? Can, we, can I go into the over-the-shoulder? I can. Okay, so there's a Puffy Blowhog. That will take care of him easily. Yeah. Oh, hello. <laughs> Woo! Well, they're done. Okay, let me... Oh, man. Let me take care of this trap. I wonder... Does the time skip work in this? I think it does. Uh, it's a technique I found in the Let's Play. Because you know how enemies that aren't on screen, they don't do anything? Well, you can... Wait, I just hit a bug! Or a, uh, a... a beetle that wasn't appeared yet <laughs> but uh you can actually use that to your advantage where you can zoom in and then approach an enemy and then you can get it on screen to have it do stuff i i called it the time skip which you'll understand once dragon ball super gets there we're getting close in the english dub but we're not quite there do it die there Okay, uh, there's a buried thing here, and there's the key. You know, thinking about it, I, I made a comment earlier in the, the LP about how I actually don't like the treasure gauge, and I think this is a good example, because, okay, one thing I, I ran into the LP, which you don't know about, is quite often due to the random, the randomness of how the stages are laid out, K there are certain rooms that are just empty, right? Yeah. They don't serve a purpose. Oh, wait. Uh, actually, he says the same thing, so we don't need... We can skip that. And so, when you have the treasure gauge, if there's an empty room, you know that there's nothing to it, and so you just ignore it. But without the treasure gauge, you'd actually search it, making the randomness... Like, it would play to the randomness strength. And I, I think that that is kind of shown off here. With no treasure gauge, the game is actually a lot better, I think. Oh, I, I kind of hogged all the Pikmin to myself. Sorry. There's only one treasure left. Oh, there is? Oh, is so. it that one that they're carrying back? Or is there another one? I don't know. Yeah, about. I think it's just that one. Okay. Uh, was there one over behind this this thing? Like, right here? Uh, no. Then there might be one buried there. Here, you go get the whites. I didn't hear the sound. Yeah, I didn't either. So there's definitely one buried somewhere. I'll, I'll help you with my powers. There, yeah! Cool. Okay, so that'll get back really quickly. In fact, use a spray on that. Just because we have nothing left. And we're not penalized for using sprays. Here, I'll... We have no deaths. Can we on the first try? Yes, we did. I was hoping we'd do that with the first... The first challenge, but, uh... Yeah, we... I, I let a Pikmin die. Okay, let's take the spud back, proving that this is the best Zelda game of all time. Old joke is old, and... Wait, what? That's not it? That isn't it. Wait, there it is. Oh, 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 there's another one. Where are you? Oh, you're over there. Holy! I helped. And... Oh, oops. <laughs> I only, I only, uh... Gave steroids to a part, part to part of the group. I don't. Wait a minute. I don't remember this treasure. No. No. I think it's a hazelnut. Here, future pal. Where do you find that thing? It's Nutella. 
Okay. Wait, what? That's not it either. <laughs> Why are there so many? Oh, hello. Missed you. Get him. There, got him. No, you will not die this day. Okay. Oh, there's another one. Wait, what? Man, we missed a lot. Goodness, uh, they gave us a lot of time, but we sure, we sure missed a lot. What is this? Uh, this is a uh, sauerkraut? No, not sour. Is this sauerkraut? Artichoke. Artichoke. Yeah, that. I I know my vegetables. Is sauerkraut a vegetable? I don't know. Sauerkraut is a dish. It's true. What is it made of again? Cabbage. Yeah, that. Okay, get back. Here, put a white on that. There. That should be the last one, but if not, let's just sweep this area. Hopefully that's the last one. No! It's not! How? For Pete's sake. Wait, 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 wait. Is there one in base? Really? There, there's so much. Is there one here? Where... Where is this thing? Like, seriously. Where on earth? We have 88 seconds left. And they... Really... Here, go get the, some of the white Pikmin at the base. Okay. Where is this? I don't want to do this... Oh, what? Was there a beetle that we missed? Uh, maybe? But we've been everywhere by this point. How could we have missed a- No. Okay. Oh, I know what you mean. Like, legitimately missed. Like, it came out, and then it went back underground, That's entirely possible. Should we go? Yeah, we should go, and then- well, We're gonna have to do this at one again, but... It should be easier. Well, that stinks. Well, Second level. We can level. still perfect it. Hmm? We can still perfect it. Yeah, we it. still perfected it, but I do want to show off every treasure. Like, that- that's the- that's the gauge I'm going by. If we don't get all the treasures, we should do it again. So... I think we're gonna have to do it again? So, off screen, we'll just get the rest of the treasures, because that's what I'm measuring the LP by. That's- that's what our performance should be based on, so... Yeah. Wait, wait, wait! Oh, oh, oh! We found it. There it, there is. it is. We did it. So I'm guessing we just missed a beetle somehow. Exit level. So f future me can probably spot what we missed. So he can confirm or deny <laughs> the existence of a beetle that we did not. So look at the differences know. in the score. That's just one treasure. Yeah. So and not even a very valuable one. Okay, let's save and end off the video. I think that's long enough. I'm pretty sure that's long enough. That's like 10 minutes. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Next time we will conquer the Lost Toy Box and maybe the Creator's Garden as well. This has a lot of yellows. Okay, uh, if you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please click like. If you didn't, then drop a comment telling me how I could make the next episode so that you would like it. I release new episodes of Pikmin 2 every Tuesday and Thursday. I'm also let's playing Breath of the Wild right now, and new episodes of that come out every Monday and Wednesday. Okay, next time we're going to conquer some more levels. See you guys then. Fan service mode activate! There she is, in all her uh, glory. Although I think she's a little bit, I don't know, just a little bit more fetching than the last one. So, let's not knock down any of the, oh, the things. I, I got him, I got him. I am practiced at this. I am very practiced at this. Go back. Wally walk. 